It's the 4th of December, and although the Crocus Nursery is covered in snow, preparations for Chelsea must go on. We've only got 170 days until the show opens, so Mark Straver is taking Andy Sturgeon to buy plants for his 2010 garden. Mark has worked with Andy on his three previous Chelsea gardens, so knows exactly what he's looking for. And that's why he's taken Andy to the foothills of Mount Etna. Mount Etna has a unique microclimate, which is wetter and warmer than the rest of Italy, and is perfect for growing the tender evergreens that you might find in a Cornish gravel garden. Andy is using Dodonia purpurea in the garden, and is surprised at the extent of the purple coloration in the Sicilian plants. Higher temperature inside. Dodonia is like Fortinia. To get it nice red, yeah. it must be cold. So by the time this comes next year, it'll be less colour. Yes, let's say in summertime. But in May for Chelsea. May it will be quite red, but less than that. But less than that, not so deep red, yeah. so shiny. Yeah. 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 In, uh, in summertime, it turns nearly to green. So, it does it. so hopefully it'll be halfway. This side is yeah. more protected from the cold because it's in between oh, the two plants. Andy seems happy that the plants will be fine on the day. So they'll be delivered to Crocus in April when the weather warms up. Now it's time to return to the UK and see how the plants on the nursery are doing under all that snow. <laughs> 